Samsung Exynos processors will survive after switching Galaxy S23 to Snapdragon. GFK's market analysis shows that the share of Samsung's Exynos mobile processors fell from 76% in 2019 to 20% last quarter. The announcement of the Galaxy A13 and Galaxy A53 devices on Exynos chips can increase their share to 30%. The Exynos chips won't go away, although the Galaxy S23, S23 Plus, and S23 Ultra will exclusively feature Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 in all countries. Samsung will continue to install Exynos in about a quarter of its production smartphones next year. This applies mainly to models of the primary and secondary categories. The reason for choosing Snapdragon for the Galaxy S23 is not related to the problems of falling frequencies or overheating of the Exynos 2300 planned for next year, but with the advantages of the Qualcomm 5G modem in the next Snapdragon. Up to this level of development of Samsung itself is not yet up to it. At MWC 2022, Qualcomm announced a new generation of the Snapdragon X75G modem. Built on TSMC's 4 nanometers process technology, it will be part of the Galaxy S23 and other flagships in 2023. It will also be available to other manufacturers in the second half of the year. Instead of increasing the connection speed as in the Snapdragon X65, X60, X55 and X50, Qualcomm decided to keep 10 Gbps, as in the Galaxy S22, and expand the functionality and capabilities of i. Thanks to this, the manufacturer promises Qualcomm 5G i Suite, Qualcomm 5G Ultra Low Latency Suite, Qualcomm 5G Power Save Gen 3 and 4X Sub-6 Carrier Aggregation, High 5G Speeds, Large Coverage, Low Latency and Energy Efficiency. There will be support for any commercial 5G frequency range from 600 MHz to 41 GHz, for the first time aggregation of four carriers in the downlink via TDD and FDD. Wave Sub-6 Aggregation, Offline Support from Wave, Global Support for Multiple 5G SIM Cards, Rapid Commercialization of 5G Release 16 Features Through Software Updates. Apple has also put on pause plans to create its own modem and all iPhone 14 uses Qualcomm X65, writes Phone Arena.